Hello, I'm Z, and welcome to Xenotown. Now you might be, might be wondering, what is Xenotown? Right, you might be wondering that. And the answer is, it is an RPG for the most part. It is an RPG like Lace Out of Painful, uh, so, you know, something I'm kind of familiar with. But um, also, it reminds me a lot of um, Mother 1. It's also inspired a lot by, what was it, uh, Nickelodeon and Cartoon Network cartoons? Early cartoons, at least. Right? Um, those early days, uh, Cartoon Network cartoons and Nickelodeon, I believe. Uh, those two. They, they, they were good, good, you know? Uh, it's inspired by those two. Uh, but you've never heard of this game, most probably, right? Right, well, yeah, that's because of one thing. First of all, it released recently on by a indie brand, you know? Uh, Boat Meal Brothers, I believe, is the name, but I will take a second here to check it at the same time while I'm talking. And second of all, well, it didn't get much attention, but it did get my attention. And why is that? Well, it's because uh, I actually got directly contacted about this. I have this uh, game key given to me by the developers. So, uh, this is the first time I'm actually doing a video on a game that I personally didn't buy. It... It's quite weird, but yes, uh, it's my first time I've gotten a, a Steam key for a game I should play on my channel for, you know, advertising and all that. So yeah, a key has been provided by uh, both Meal Brothers. Yes, that is the name. Good. I think most of the stuff I had to say is out of the way. I'll make this a weekly series about, I don't know, I'm, I'm aiming for 40 minutes, but if it feels off, I'll, I'll adjust it. Uh, because I don't know how, how long the game is, right? The, the game might be short, or it might be long, but either way, we'll, we'll continue to play it. Alright, okay. Well, uh, then, let's start. A new game. Oh, the music is jamming so far. Uh, the music in the main menu is also really good. Alien? Go to sleep, stay awake. What if I go to sleep? Not now, soldier. You have already been asleep for the duration of our trip here. My scans calculate that you are perfectly well rested. All right, thanks for the for the scan. Ooh, Jean. Check back here periodically for assistance. I have no useful information for you right now, Dill. Dill. Mm. Items, no items. Skills, no skills yet. The game is really smooth, which I love. It's not like 15 FPS like the old games or something like that, you know? Equip. Currently have nothing on us. We have weapons, shield, shirt, gloves, and necklace. Uh, oh yeah, I was gonna say. Although, I think, although this is like a game key provided by the developers, I, I hope that I'm doing the right thing, but I'm not gonna hold back if I have any criticism about the game, but I will praise it for where it has praise, right? So far, the soundtrack is really good, I'm liking that, and the, and it's smooth. It's smooth, uh, as in like 60 FPS or more, I'm, I'm not quite sure. Uh, cursor memory, that's pretty good. It's a nice mechanic. Um, battle hold. And when unable to holding down a key in battle will make it auto rapid fire, even across turns. Oh, okay. Confirm cancel sub. Yep, that's all regular old stuff. Repeat rate. Faster rate means faster response. Not sure what that means, but okay. And we can just save anywhere we want. That is also a very nice thing. Alright, it doesn't seem... Uh, Z to confirm, press X to decline or out of menus. You must save your game manually. Okay, that's good. It doesn't seem like I can run. So we'll have to normally walk. There is a door there. I did think about checking it out. Yep. Flashing sparkles signify an object or vending machine is interactive. interactable. Yeah, well, what about the door? You aren't equipped for a spacewalk, soldier. Get over here and pilot our landing. Alright, we've got like an AI. Inspect the guy you trade in the dispensary deal. Grab some rations. Obtain the canned beet lo bleed loaf. I synthesized some earth food for you. I only scanned tiny portions of the planet. So that's all the information I had. I don't know why it's slightly going towards like a British accent. Slowly. A mass produced goat themed meatloaf from Hungary. Adds 20 health. I live near Hungary, I have never heard of this, although I'm not denying that it may be, you know, an actual thing. Hungarians are weird people, in uh, in my opinion. But not in the bad sense, you know, just in like the... You're kind of quirky, you have a lot of unique things about you, kind of sense. A picture of the plains of Ziganes. 
Ziganese? Yeah. Or Zygenes as well. Ziganese or Zygenes. I like the I like the sound of Ziganese. Although I will say Zygenes. Uh, all right. So yeah, a picture of the planes of Zygenes is riveted into the table. Home sweet home. All right, Robo Man. What do you have to tell me? When we arrived, gaze upon. Oh, well, we have arrived. Gaze upon a Ziganite. Colony number two hundred one two two one. See it in the window? But it is not our colony yet. We have been honored with the task of securing a footfall, uh, uh, securing a foothold in this planet for our great empire. You may be a new recruit, but your mission is relatively simple. Invade the planet, disguised as a natural inhabitant, blend in with our in the. What am I saying? Blend in with the wildlife, if you will. We will then place our mind control optics on as many as we can. Start with some lower level level individuals, and then we can move up and gain control over Earth's most powerful leaders. Then we shall set up a beacon for reinforcements. Our full invasion will be made infinitely easier once we gain control over their leaders. So you are just getting the conquest started. Got it? I sure have. Uh, yeah. A silent determination. Very promising indeed. I shall let you pilot the ship down to Earth. Try to land somewhere that seems secluded. Hmm. Yeah, wouldn't the drones have picked this up? The satellites? Satellite drones and stuff like that. Here's our error detected. Pilot has hit, has hit multiple pieces of debris. We are experiencing altitude complications. Redirecting course. Initiating emergency landing. Ah. You have crashed our vessel. Perhaps the harm to our vessel is only cosmetic? Assessing damage. Our ship has been ruined. It is utterly beyond repair. It would also appear that you have crashed into the middle of an inhabited area. We have crashed in a dump. The humans deposit their waste here. How vile. Not the best start, but we can scan for a disguise for you. And you will need to establish a new base. I was able to drop a housing module not too far from here. Find it and activate it. My scans also indicate that you'll need to be disguised as a child on Earth due to your height, height deficiency. Don't make fun about, about my guy's height, okay? Don't do that. That's not... Oh, oh, man. This could actually be advantageous. Posing as one of their youth should arouse less suspicion. You'll be able to get away with more than an adult without raising alarms. Well, head out there. We have work to do. My subsystems will be transferred into your onboard implants. We shall be together every step of the way. If you need assistance, hit the gene button in your menu. What was this? Oh, the picture cracked. Oh. Grab some rations. It would appear that this nutrient dispenser is completely broken. Ruined, wasted, violated even. Much like our ship. Ziganite soldiers are adaptable. You'll find plenty to eat on this planet. Alright, what about my- Oh, my- My- My sleep chamber! Go to sleep? Your growth vat was completely destroyed in the crash. Try not to dwell on your mistakes, soldier. Perhaps your in inadequacy as a pilot signifies that you have skills in other aspects of life. Right, right. Compensating, are we now? The dumps. We have landed in the dumps. Ooh. Oh, Jesus Christ, that scared me. Holy shit, that gave me a legit jump scare. I don't I think that's worse than when I played Amnesia. I was like, oh, this is such a calming music, and then out of nowhere it's just like this loud just tsh sound effect. Christ. <laughs> Sorry about that. Yeah. Ah, ship power has reached zero. Well, we'll have to work with the base generator that has dropped somewhere in town. Improvisations. Uh, no, improvisations. Drama. Nothing you cannot handle. I've given him an easy voice, as I think I'll have to voice him quite a lot. An easy voice to do, you know. Ooh, it is nighttime. Can we look in the trash? Oh, no. Okay, so the shining object signifies always that there's gonna be something. Obtain the canned beet loaf. Oh. Some some fell from the ship. Um, Pineville city dump. I'm expecting that it fell. I can't get to the fridge. Oh, well, that's disappointing. I wanted to check what's inside the the fridge. What delicacy could be inside? Oh shit! 
that didn't have a shining thing, but uh, this is quite something. Shrink wrapped sardines. Prepackaged sardines, not boneless. 14 health and 8 pizzazz. Ooh. Carl's La Jazzy Juice. I was gonna say Lazzy. Puts a little jazz in your step. 18 pizzazz. The pizzazz, I'm gonna guess, is my like magic mana, whatever it may be, you know? Uh, energy. For the financially devastated individual, arrives heals party member for uh, to 25% health. Generic energy drink. Really? Larry's leg lotion. Okay, so it seems like they're color coded to each roll. So this is healing. This is energy and revive. Created by beauty expert La Larry Leg <laughs> Leg with three G's Meyer. <laughs> Your slippery allies will be harder to hit. Increases evasionness by eight percent. Evasiveness, not evasionness. Close enough, right? All right. So yellow seems to be buffs. Uh, made from an oh wait micro molotov. How do you make a micro molotov? Do you do you just grab one of those like small bottles of alcohol and like throw it with a like a a cloth and set it on fire? You know, like a molotov does. Made from an airport-sized container of vodka. Yeah, airport-sized container. Okay, a vodka and a napkin. Oh, that's yeah. You could make that on a plane, huh? Probably shouldn't. Probably shouldn't. Does 15 damage and inflicts burn for two turns. Oh, this might be like a... This, the red ones might be like a debuff on the enemies or damaging uh, items. A small firework... Oh, yeah, it's a firecracker. A small firework left unused from last summer. Does 31 damage and inflicts burn for two turns. So it's just... It's just a better version of this for one buck. That's cool. Backwash bottle bomb. Okay, that's green. A half-drunk bottle of soda, partially filled with spit and food chunks, does 19 damage and inflicts gross for 4 turns. Eh. Ah. Okay. Gross. I'm gonna have to find out what most of these uh, effects mean. Go in here? No? Okay. Go in here? No? Mm -mm. I'll be trying to explore most stuff, as I gotta say, there will not... Um, be any guides that I could use to help me when I'm uh, playing this game, right? Because this game, I looked it up, this game has no guides, relatively no discussions about it, and no videos on YouTube except for the trailer for the game. So I really am going in as blind as I can. If I get stuck on something, I'll literally have to ask the developer for help. Or the developers, rather. Use the confirm button to go up and down ladders. Buy consumables for battles from vending machines. You know, so, so far... Oh, we don't have a climb and, and descend animation? Those, uh... Those, that, like, hill effect is really funky. It reminds me of, like, a Jojo hill effect. You know, you know the... Uh, the wall eyes, I think they're called? Or something like that in uh, chapter 8 of Jojo, I think? Or part 8. Bill, look at that sign. Silent as ever. Skateboard for it. Uh, skateboard fevers. Prodigy Matt McCheddar shows you how to kickflip over the homeless in downtown Reno. The Earth's child in that sign looks about your height. That should be a very suitable disguise. Scanning. Processing. Excellent. You look just like a normal Earthling. Okay. <laughs> if you say so. Since you're shorter than the adults, you'll have to pose as a child. Our holograms can only do so much. Computing. My scans indicate that Earth children usually have a pair of parents. A bit different from Zygonite growth vats. You'll have to find some parents to maintain cover for you for the first few days here. Dill, find some other adult Earthlings. Beat them into co in combat and then place our mind control optics. That was a video finishing anything, my bad on that one. On their feeble minds. But first, set up the base for us. Onward, soldier. Skateboard fevers, yeah. Okay, so now I'm, uh, I'm still Dill, but, uh, I'm... <laughs> you know what he looks like? He looks like a... A 9 to 10 year old... Uh, like... Half white, half black kid. Um, that's trying to become a SoundCloud rapper, that's what that haircut looks like. A bit. And the glasses really remind me of, um... Oh, was it Kids Next Door, right? That, that cartoon. It really reminds me of that. 
Uh, all right. Gene, build the housing module. Oh, why is my mouse showing up? I, I, hold on, let me disable that. If my mouse has been showing up, I hope I, hope I haven't had it on screen all episode. I hope it was some, somewhere where you can see it. Where? Okay, there's the game. Uh, capture cursor. No, I do not want you to capture cursor, preferably. Build a housing module, though. Uh, I don't think we've reached that point yet. Closed. Makes sense. But also kind of doesn't, right? Some people might need gas, gas in the middle of night. Doesn't really make too much sense, actually, now that I think about it more and more. Siesta SZN. Closed for the night. I see. Quite uh, quite calming, this uh, this place here is. I'm gonna save. I, I kind of like Dill as an alien more, though. Like, he had a very cool design. I like that design a lot. Like, a lot, a lot. Alright. Return to the objective. Uh, that being? Ah, the housing module. You managed to locate it. What are you waiting for, soldier? Set up your cover home. Even these primitive earthlings might grow suspicious if one of their young didn't have a home to reside in. Perfect deal. Now let's find you some parents. Hmm. Can I go inside my home? No. Locked. Alright. Bird. We can do reconnaissance when we when the night ends, Dill. Get back to work. And slave a pair of parents and set up our base. I'm guessing oh, there's Hey bud. What are you doing out so late? It's not safe at night in Pineville. We have a serious problem with rabbit dogs and don't even get me started on the muggers. There are buggers everywhere. Stealing shit left and right. Breaking into homes, they'll mug anyone. Women, men, children, even the homeless. I'm one of them. Give me all your cash. Ooh, that was a nice transition into combat. Solar slap. An electrically charged smack from outer space. Has a lower success rate than other moves. Stuns and deals minor damage. Let's try it. They'll dodge. Nice. Solar slap. And he got stunned. Time to attack now. Yep. Alright, I feel like the, the combat could be a bit more... How would I put this into words? Active. I don't know. So what, here I'm going to start an attack, right? It doesn't feel like I've actually been attacked or have attacked because, first of all, the animation should be a bit slower. Second of all, it should the character should shake a bit more to, uh, like, to indicate what has actually happened. And maybe the effect should be a, a bit bigger. Okay, so crits make your screen go red, but only for a split second, so you might miss them. Hmm. I guess it's fast combat. Nine bucks. Hey. Con congrats, soldiers. It's a soldier. You gain no experience in that battle. I shall investigate the issue. Ignore it for the moment. Well, I like the glasses. Good on you giving back to the community. You know, I'm feeling kind of charitable now. I'm paying five, five bucks. I need to get some rest. Alright, so... <laughs> I gained no experience. That is a current bug. That is a current ongoing bug that the devs have told me about. Otherwise, I would have played this a bit earlier than I, uh, than I currently... You know, am. I would have played it a week earlier. A week earlier, this game. But, um, that is still an ongoing bug, so I'm just gonna play it. Right there to the objective. Okay, well, oh, here's a person. Whoa, did you see that crash? Must have been satellite or something. Slime him? Huh, you right, kid? What do you mean, slime him? No, what the hell is this goop? What's wrong with you? You know what? Every day, these kids mess with me. Why are you drooling on that gas pump, Grandma, Grandpa? Please stop pissing in public. I've had it. You wanna throw down, punk? Fine, let's go. Oh, he's got a... I don't know if I can do this. Alright, he got stunned. Oh, he can move again. Try and stun him, stun him, stun him again. There we go. Oh, it's only one one turn worth of stun. It's not really worth it. 
gonna heal. All right, Solar Slap. Yeah, so it's only one turn of stun. That's really not, not that great. No more throwing down for me. I'm getting too old for this. I think I'm going to head home. All right, Dill, head back to base. Unlock the front door. Your new parents will be waiting for you. Don't even have to head back. He just sent me back. What is this home? What is this home, man? It looks funky. That's what I'll say about it. It, it sure does look funky. Well, welcome home, son. You know, late days, sport, going on adventures, meeting women. Should be more careful when you're out that late. There are vandals and muggers everywhere. Our boy isn't afraid of that. The child is brave. I'm so proud of his many accomplishments. And he looks just like his parents. Yeah, sure. Yes, just like his parents. Son, you need, you need to sleep. School starts at 8 a.m. Excellent. Nobody could ever doubt your identity as an athlete with these added authenticity of the parents. What a charming family. A charming family. Go to bed, Dill. We have school to infiltrate. Alright. Oh, it, we've got this much in the base. Ah, taking a glance at your old growth bad footage. Just look at your prior state of development. How endearing. I find it motivating to show soldiers how far they've grown in a literal sense. I wonder if these humans do anything similar. Sure, sure, yeah. You could say so. Man, how long uh, how long do I have to walk to my bedroom? Oh, here. A new unbroken picture of the plains of the Siganese. Home sweet home. I replicated another food item for you, Dill. A delicacy of Earth cuisine. Shrimp crab sardines, yeah, thanks. I, uh, I already read about those. What is this? Is this a carpet? The hatch is locked. Oh, it's a hatch. Okay. Dale's restoration tank. Wait until dawn. Stay up. Computer. Min mind control optic generator. For use on semi intelligent life forms only. Okay. Come and talk to me after you rest. I'll rest. Dill, come and converse with me. I see that you have attained an adequate period of rest. Our first mission is to infiltrate the nearby school. Juvenile Earthlings are educated there. We can find whoever is in charge and get them in, get them under our control. Gaining power over the local youth should be a trivial. It should be trivial. Should be trivial once we control the school's leader. There is also the bonus of school's staff being weaker examples of humans. Additionally, we should try to find an Earthling who, should, who will cooperate with us voluntarily. Some of my scamming, scanning ability was lost in high, the highly avoidable crash due to our unskilled pilot. We did just make a newborn pilot a ship, right? I will be unable to learn about the creatures and customs of Earth in high detail. Additionally, we may need assistance in combat. As you know, the docile creatures under our control are rendered worthless in combat. So try to find a human who will help us and get, her, get around the town and assist us in battle. Oh, well, who will help us get around the town and assist us in battle. Get going, soldier. Alright, thank you, thank you. It feels great to have such a, a good uh, parent. Go to school after you go home and rest. Good objective, you know. It's what I do every day. Wake up, go to school, get, get back, do videos. Good morning, son. You need some lunch money? You know, back in my day, I didn't get lunch money from my parents. I had to earn it from other people at knife point. Nod your head, yes. Three bucks. Get some good grades for me, son. Incredible. Good morning, son. I took a shower this morning. Haven't had one in years. Get some good grades at school. These scholarships won't earn themselves. Alright. Egg time? Welcome to egg time. May I take your order? 
frothed, frothed egg whites over yolky cappuccino. 30 pizzazz. Bottled yolkuccino and frothy yolkuccino. Strange blended egg and coffee mixture. Alright, make sure you keep on, uh, up on that egg intake. These nutrients will keep you healthy all the way to old York's home. Hello there. You try one of the egg coffees and put too much shell in mine. Yep. That isn't very good. Yep. You know, sometimes I wish we had a normal coffee shop in town. Yep. So far, so good. Cola? Oh, hell yeah. Got enough money to actually buy stuff, so I guess I will. I will buy another one of these since it's cheap. I will also buy one of these. And probably one of these. And one of these, I think. Alright. No, actually, no, I'll buy a bit more. I'll buy some, uh, some more food. Locked. Hmm. Should not. It should not be. Locked. Alright. Ooh, who's that? Who are those people? The bridge repair might take a long time. Can you believe this was the only way to get to downtown Pineville? I sure can, because I don't know what that is. Locked. Okay. The arcade. Went out for Grog. We'll be back soon. Oh, hell yeah. Why does everyone have a van around here? Locked. Grandma's gets. Ah, a victim of primitive wheel-based transportation methods. How oh, very tragic. Someone just ran over a deer? I feel like you would also see the crashed car. That shit would completely wreck your car. Deer have a bit of strength, believe me. I'm guessing all of these are gonna be locked except for that egg market. Egg egg coffee shop actually. Yeah, most of these are gonna be locked. Pineview. What what is this? Also, music is too loud. Let me turn that down. That did not save. Okay, I have to like actually save the settings. Yeah, apply. Should be better now. Should be better. Music is still slapping so far. Oh, is this cool? Fine view. Okay. Then three canned beet loaf. Alright, well, that's good. I already bought a lot of it, so. Hello, who are you? Oh. What's up, man? You here for before school attention? Not big on words, huh? That's cool. I'm just serving the halls. I'm a moderator. Us moderator halls have. Us, uh, us hall moderators have to be adaptable, athletic, agile. And most of all, we have to be great at detecting anything suspicious. Well, I'll see you around. Yeah, you sure didn't do a good, good job at it. Maybe it's because you're a kid. Also, why are there... Why are there desk and, desks and chairs in the hallway? That yeah, feels a bit off. Hold on, Dale. I can sense Earthling drama occurring. Can't keep doing this, Tyler. You're always stealing in these fights. You can't throw other students into desks. I don't... Rochelle, it's called a power bomb, and she made fun of my trailer. Don't use my first name. You know I spent six years becoming a teacher. I deserve better. Don't need to mean mention this is the uh, mention this in the next parent teacher conference. No, I didn't think so. Get your act together fast, and don't swipe anything on on your way out. Come on, I barely take anything from this dump. I don't know what to do with these animals. Where did my stapler go? Tyler, get back here, young man. Who are you? Are you here for detention? Hey, you aren't supposed to be wearing sunglasses inside school. It violates dress code. Hello? These kids get weirder and weirder. Ill! Provoke the human into consensual combat. You must gain control of the human subjects. Slime the teacher's chair. Push papers off the desk. Really? Random students ruining my workspace. You know how much depth I took in to teach you animals? Enough! Alright. Using pencils? 
Ah, awesome. What is invincible? Any attacks? Enemy attacks do no damage. 50% chance for one turn. Oh, that's interesting. I don't think I need that. I'm bleeding. Uh-oh. Oh, and you dodged. Invincible. Yes. Uh, it's just defend. But with a chance of failure. Really? They added defend, but with a chance of failure. That is a interesting mechanic. I'm still bleeding. Which is not ideal. I am no longer bleeding. Never mind. Yeah, it would be nice if um, the solar slap would last more than a second. Can I just keep doing solar slaps? Yeah, I can. Guess this is why the. Oh, you dodged. Shit. This is. I guess this is why they added the whole uh, you know it misses often thing. Cause like you can just kind of do that. All right. We got a decently good chance at winning here. Oh, really? One HP. Painted. Oh, I don't think that's what we're supposed to be doing here. Ah, your cloak malfunctioned. Hopefully it won't happen again. Let me fix that. Excellent. Back to normal. It's a good thing that no Earthlings saw you in the disguise, right? Th Is that an alien? Negative. There are no aliens here. Who said that? That's the fake kid. That, that fake kid didn't move his mouth. I saw him. He's like an octopus thing. And you beat Rochelle's ass. Is she okay? Trevor, how's my favorite student doing? Favorite student? So, is she brainwashed or something then? What are you talking about, Trevor? You may have had a concussion in that, in that fight today. Your mind control really sucks, dude. She even got my name wrong. Yeah, it has worked perfectly in over 12,342 planetary invasions. You must be more perceptive than the average Earthling. Would you like to be recruited, human? Recruited? You joking? We require a guide. Many of my sensors are damaged. You could always decline, but they will put optics onto you. But what if I just haul ass before you can put them on? I'll tell everybody. Tell everybody. Does that feeble earth mind think that they can that they will believe you? Well, if I help you, can I get like a spaceship or something? One ship, fighter or frigate cast? Both. And unlimited nachos. And you gotta help me deal with something before I help you with anything. What poor negotiation skills. The earth child could have requested ten ships. Deal. Great. How to recruit someone? 101. Uh, what is this? Oh, we, we're, we're playing Hangman. R, a G, and L is wrong. It's probably gonna be... Cheese. You know, ch the, the C? Also, if R, L, and G is wrong, that should not be how many body parts there are on Hangman. Also, Hangman is a, it's just a very graphic child game. You know what I mean? Hanging yourself? That's, uh... That's a bit... You know over the edge, but no one really says anything about it. We're going to the trailer park. For what purpose? You guys can beat uh, beat adults in a fight. I need your help taking care of somebody. We should stop and get burgers for, uh, for burger first, though. There's a place right outside of school. You know, I'm just assuming that aliens can eat burgers. What's up, man? You're, okay, uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, we already know this text. Yep, you'll see me around. Go to Meat Burger. Meat Burger! Then go to the trailer park with Tri Tyler. Am I still doing the right voice? I feel like I've changed his voice by now. That's fine though. It's just my style. 18 pizzazz, that seems about right. Did I get any money for that? I did. I stole the teacher's money. That's so great. I love that. I need more pizzazz juice though. So how about we, first of all, get one of these, and then pizzazz juices. Yeah, that should be good. Also, one more actual heal. Yes. Going out. So far, the game is pretty smooth, you know? The combat, I think, could be improved a bit, but, uh... That's about it. That's about all I have to complain about. 
So, you know, that's pretty... I, I don't like the clown thing. Hey, man. Do you have any extra bucks? Maybe some insect repellent? I don't. I don't have any. I, uh, really don't. Locked. Very good. Very good. A bees? We have a... a... a bee nest. Or hive. Hive, is it? Hive. Motel. So, Tyler. Okay. Do you know any skills, Tyler? Trailer Park Tussle. Learn how many... Uh, learn over many years of uh, backyard beatdowns. Does low damage to all enemies and inflicts bleed. Oh, that's pretty good. It's an actually pretty good one. Can I talk to you? 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 I'm trying to mow this field, son. Please get out of my way. Alright, sure will do. Kevin's combat hole. Do you also... Do you hear, do you hear my voice get worse and worse as I do that voice? Uh, yeah. <coughs> Right, back to my normal voice, uh, for once. Meat Burger. I love the name. It was also next to school. Oh. You fellas here to eat? Nice. Nice. I'm just here to taste. I'm on a diet. Yep. So I just put that food in my gullet and let it simmer. Marinate. Festa. Absorb all them flavors. Then spit it back on the plate. I leave that slippery mess on the table with a nice tip for the waiter too. I'm down 15 pounds already. Yep. Tint Larry's leg lotion. Okay. Yeah. Uh, this place seems like an absolute hellhole. I like how his shirt just says burger. Bur burger. Welcome to Meat Burger. Are you ready to uh, meet your burger? It's perfect that it's one buck because I do not have more money than that. Do I actually have to eat? Oh, and then go to the trailer park. Also, for one burger, that was one dollar. How much health? Oh my gee, holy shit, that's so good. I mean, just go to Meat Burger, right? Maybe they're sold out though. No. Trailer park. Trailer park, maybe up here? Your door has five padlocks. Why do you need five of them? Or I've seen like one or two, maybe even three on stuff, but like five? How are you doing that day? Pretty hard to believe that I got up here all by myself, huh? Look, I want I know what you're thinking. And no, I'm definitely not stuck up here. He's stuck up there. Admit it, you are stuck. Uh, okay. Is this where the trailer park is? All the way up here? I am kind of beginning to believe it's not. Maybe it is. Hello, lads. Live in my van? Not in the middle of town. I'd never do that. That's illegal. I'm just having some van trouble. Waiting for tow. Yep. Might be a few months before I can get a tow. With that bridge out. Yep. I had to set up an emergency tent and everything. Yep. You know, back in my day, we didn't worry so much about vagrancy and loitering. I miss them days. Yep. There's like a lot of homeless people around here. And all the people with homes seem to keep them locked. I wonder why. Really, I do. I mean, I mean, what would be the reason to keep your home locked when there's like seven homeless people on the street? Yeah, I, I don't know. That's, that's a good question, right? I like how derpy he looks when I'm walking like sideways like that. His glasses just like tilt in a way that makes him look a real derpy. Police department. I don't really want to go there, to be honest. Also, is that a grave? God damn. That's if someone died. And that's his body. Or the remains of his body at least. Alright, I, I gotta say, objectives in this game are quite clear. That was one of the things I was scared of, and so far I'm I'm glad that's not the case, but I was scared the objectives in this game would be very vague, and I wouldn't know what to do or where to go and stuff like that, and I currently don't know where to go, but I'm sure I'll find it since this place is not that big, you know? But it tells you what you have to do. Very, quite, quite literally, straight up tells you what I have to do. 
This is the garbage dump, right? Oh no, this is the trailer park. You could be one adult in a fight, so I bet you can do a lot together, right? Let's go. Uh, wait, just just a second. Wait. Alright. Hey, jackass! Where's my lava lamp? I don't know why you took it. Oh my god, it's him again. Dude, he smells like a dump. Buzz off. Lamp is up your ass, Tyler. But no, that's your mom's wedding ring. Disgusting. They would... Dude, we beat you like twice this week. Can you just let it go? Guess we gotta do it again. Hell no, that ain't happening. Hell no. Uh, we're gonna uh, solo slap this guy and then we're gonna trailer park tussle. Oh shit. Stop attacking Dill. God damn. Eat the meat burger. Oh, taunt. Failed to taunt. Alright. This might be a bit more difficult than the other ones. I, I'm guessing you're supposed to have a higher level already for this fight, but since there is that issue, you know. Uh, we're having a bit of a trouble, so... Uh, we're having a bit of trouble already. We should be able to beat this, though. It might be a bit difficult. Sardine should help. Yeah, good, good. Very good. The one with the bat is really going for me, you know, I gotta take him out. I mean, yeah, he's the, he's the main problem so far. How much do you do without the special attack thing? Six, that's quite a bit. Alright, so attack him and then attack... No, actually. You heal up. You use a trailer park tussle. Shit, you fainted. Yeah, I knew that was a possibility. I just didn't think it would happen. Okay, well then we gotta use one of those energy drinks. Here we go. Uh, drink. Or eat this, and then you eat this. Because this last guy doesn't do any damage, so it's fine. We're completely fine here. Might as well try to slow solar slap him while doing a tussle. Yep. Perfect. And I, I think we can just stack him normally now. Oh yeah, we got this. Nice, nice. Good job, good job. Still no EXP, sadly. Might get difficult if this is still like the case in a bit. They're like mind control now, right? Correct. Docile organic subordinates through and through. That not that right, human? Humans. Yup. Sure. It's pretty weird. Whatever. I'll get used to it. Where's my lava lamp? We had it two days ago. It's hidden in a parking lot south of town by the train tracks. Power plug was messed up. Looked like a rat shoot through it or something. There was a key floating around in the lava l l lamp group. Pretty weird. Definitely weird. Didn't want that trash. Figures. So it's by down. It's down by the train tracks. Then let's find that lamp. We'll deal with that. We'll deal with. Then we'll deal with my dad. Ah, a betrayal of his own parent. Is this a practice common among Earth offspring? Hey, you agree to it to help me? If I help you with all, with all your alien shit, we don't need to talk about it, okay? How very dramatic. Organic life is truly fascinating. Where is our objective? Wide trailer. Wooden panels. Pretty nice place. Well, we need the lamp first. Get to work, dude. 
I'm kind of confusing their voices. I'm not good at doing voices, multiple voices at once, you know? Anyways, I am going to save here, however. And I am also going to leave it here, I believe. So, you know, if you enjoyed this first episode of uh, Xenotown, uh, I would highly appreciate you leaving a like, uh, as I will know to do more of it. I mean, I will surely do more of it, but... I'm just curious if people actually like these, these types of games, because I sure do. I love this game so far. It's actually really good. This is this is definitely what you would call a hidden gem, right? Anyways, yeah, I'm going to leave it here. So uh, if you enjoyed this episode, leave a like. Have an awesome rest of the day, and I will see you next week.